Right, hello and welcome to the Brand New Eyes Community Remix. So yeah, I'm possibly going to play and record a fair amount of... Maybe. Because Rebirth has been announced for a while, but it's been like given a date on Steam, which is in about two months. So, yeah. Uh, I... Hang on, I need to change some stuff. Um, hang on, let me actually not do that. Let's do this. That seems better, I think. Yeah. And I'll scare off screen. So yeah, I'm not the most phenomenal finding as it were. I used to play a lot of it, but I kind of stopped and I got less good, as that happens with like everything you do. If you stop doing it, you will probably tend to suck at it. Uh-huh. Unless that action is sucking, in which you're sucking at sucking is probably a good thing. I <laughs> uh, don't know where that was going. Uh, yeah. So, Community Remix adds several items, it changes some items, and it makes some items trinkets and vice versa. It also adds some music. And add some tarot cards, and I think that's about it, really. It does quite a decent. I kind of want that. It does quite a decent amount of stuff. So, if you haven't played the Band of Isaac, then I am playing Isaac, who has D6, which allows you to really roll items, such as the Spoon Bender in there, which gives me homing tears, which I would kind of like. So, we are going to probably take that and we'll re-roll the boss. I just knocked my thing. So, yeah. Uh, we're fighting this, Steven, I think. Oh god, then I got hit. Bad. Doesn't really matter because it's the first floor and I haven't got a devil room chance. Which is affected by if you take red heart damage on the floor or the boss. And the boss counts as... Both, I think. So, obviously, you don't want to take red heart damage on the boss, otherwise, you are screwed in regards to the devil room chance. I think they both provide 35% and you have like a 35 base, maybe? I think. Don't quote me on that. That's what I think it is. I think you have a 35 base and then you get a 35. Or if you take red heart damage on the floor, 35%, and if you take it on the boss, another 35%, so that way you end up with a 105%, a 105%, and then if you have a devil room on the previous floor, then you have got a... 0.25 multiplier? Yes, I could re-roll that sweet. Okay. It's been a good floor actually. Um So we've got a damage upgrade instead of a familiar, which I'd much rather have. And um, we've got Spoon Bender, which is a pretty nice uh, homing effect. So that's a good floor actually. <laughs> it's a very good floor. Um I could look for the secret room. Now, where could it be? It could theoretically be here, I think. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, it can, good. And then we get the arc. Okay. So, if I die, I now respawn as Blue Baby. Which is... Okay, I guess. I keep all my upgrades, it's just I don't keep my health and I stop with three soul hearts. But I suppose if we have like permanent polar ornaments, but we also want that later on, then that could be fine. 
Don't want to go in there yet. I do want to go in there. Don't want to go in there yet because I will take red heart damage and then I will lose a good portion of my devil room chances. Okay, thank you to the key game. I was about to ask, could I get a key? And then I got one before I didn't ask. Chocolate milk, I don't like. It gives you charge shots, but you have to hold it and then release it or you can just like fire quickly but you have to tap and it's annoying and I'll have lots of annoying tapping noises in the background and I'll be annoying myself by having to tap repeatedly because tapping is annoying so we're not taking that we're going to re-roll that hopefully uh, homing could be doing a bit more for me here you know oh my god come on, come on homing thank you Jesus Oh. Pliss, no, I don't like this room. God damn it, there goes my first bit of my devil room chance. I've still got an okay ish chance. I should still have about 70%, which isn't terrible. I think that's what I have. I'm not 100% sure. But, since we've done that, we can now go to this room and not care. Ah, great. <laughs> that is actually good, but... Yeah, now they don't count as red heart damage if I lose them. But it's a bit late for that, don't want that. So, unfortunately, we are down a bit of a devil room chance. Um, but, like I said, I think I've still got 70% chance, maybe. Or I might, might be wrong, I'm going to have to up at some point in the future. But, yeah. If we've still got 70%, that's a decent chance. So it could happen, and why couldn't I have gotten that bit earlier? Uh, should wait until I've got two thirds of a re-roll before fighting the boss. Really. So if I get the Del Room, I can re-roll it. I hate these guys. You cost me my Devil Room chance before. Jerks. Now you're dead for it. Um... The secret room has got to be here. Three cents. Not amazing, definitely not enough to go to the shop, even though we've got enough keys to go. So, screw that, I guess. Let's go fight our boss. We will not get no reroll, so we'll either reroll the boss item, the door room, or the item room. Well, we won't be re-rolling the boss item because I know he walked into him because the horseman always drop a cube of meat. Guaranteed. And even if you re-roll it, you will still have another cube of meat. Calm down, blow, um... Uh, not war. Famine? I'm not sure. I don't know the horseman too well. Don't know the horseman of the apocalypse and stuff, so yeah. No devil room. A lot of soul hearts though. So hopefully we will get a devil room on the next floor. And because I've got that, I'm comfortable doing this. And hopefully this will mean I can go too. Yes, I can. Pet it and go to the shop. I could have went anyway. Uh, ladder's kind of terror bad. But I'm going to buy it. Now that's a dumb thing to go. Oh, that's, that's a piece of crap. I'll buy it. Hey, you know I'm in this shiny computer store? Yeah, you've got all these new ones. I'll take that rusted piece of crap in the corner, please. I will happily take that. So, not really a wise decision, but it can be useful, so. Uh, that's a community remix item. It lets you reroll bosses. So, I'm curious that if I use this after I've beaten the boss in the boss room, if I will get another boss fight. I don't think I will, but if I do that'd be quite cool, so here we go.
Oh, no. Oh, well. That sucks. That would have been cool if I had. Oh, well. Can't always get what you want, but you try sometimes to get what you need and stuff, so... Let's pick up our D6. Which says D6 now in this, which I'm pretty sure it's a normal mine reference from the Community Remix Makers. So let's just go down, there's nothing else for us to do here. I, I'm actually going to blow that up. I'm out of bombs now, which kind of sucks, but... I got some money and got my heart back. Just don't want to be seeing Isaac peeing between rooms, it's very embarrassing. He should be ashamed of himself. A baby peeing? Who's ever heard of such a thing? Ah, there's Judgment. However, he takes bombs and I've got none. God damn it, Judgment, you suck. Now this battle either sucks. I, c I can't get to that. It's so bad. It's so close. If only I had flight. Flight is much better than the ladder. Stupid ladder. This is a nice easy room and I can get myself up to full health. And I get a bomb. I will save a couple of bombs before I start trying to trade them to bomb judgment. So I don't think I explain what the cube of meat does. It damages enemies and blocks tears, which is what the projectile in this game is. I kind of want the blue one to be over land when I kill him, and not the land in the middle, because I can't get to that. Because he can drop an item. When I say an item, I mean like a consumable. I've got... Why have you... Stupid shot speed. Come on. No, get back over there. Good. That was actually worth the trouble. That actually was worth the trouble. Wow. Um, because I'm fairly confident I'll get enough to go to the shop, I'm going to go in here. Oh. We want that. That gives me re-rolls when I take damage. Which I will probably do a lot of, so we need to get three more cents. That is for Darnager. Right. It's like a combination between two rooms I've recently just done. I'm just going to do the same thing I did before and just like go around the edges. Okay. Come on. Follow. There we go. I want that. Do I want that more than something to give to judgment? I do, yeah. I think that gives me an eternal heart or flight. I think it's an eternal heart. So we'll set that to the end before because that'll be a health up then. Uh, don't know why my FPS has died in this room. I mean, there's a fair amount going on. But my computer should be able to handle it. It's probably because if I know that my head is a Java game and Java isn't the greatest thing ever. It's pretty good. Not the greatest thing ever. Great thing I have a sliced bread. Until someone comes along with the greatest thing since sliced bread, then you know. Then we're still just sliced bread. Two champions of these guys, I'm surprised I don't like have the champions belt or awesome. something. Which gives you more champion spawns and more damage. Which we will hopefully find later in the shop. I'm glad he doesn't do contact damage. At least I don't think he does, or I was very close to hitting him and he actually does. We will hopefully never know. About the boss. The first boss. Okay, I get a second level cube of meat which would fire alongside me as well as block tears and do damage to enemies on contact. Or I could re roll it to something else because he is the first boss of two on this floor and he can have his item re rolled to the second boss. So I think I'm going to do that. And hopefully the second boss is like um, the four one or something. That'd be amazing. I think get three devil room items. Oh, that actually hit me. Wow. I thought I was fast enough to avoid that. Obviously not. 
Just die already. I'm sick of fighting these horsemen. Right, we roll that. Okay, so it's not for the next boss, unfortunately. But I do get a health up. So that's something. Alright, let's go get some. Uh, let's go get two thirds of a re roll. So that we can have a re roll ready. I've got red tears now. Have I had that for a while? I can't remember. <laughs> let's go get. Two thirds of a re-roll so we can have one ready for the hopeful devil room that we'll get. God damn globins, go away. Aha! I had the ladder, bitch. I wish my homing would do more. I really do. But it's clearly not. Are yeah, you just stand there? Good. Okay, two keys from that room, that's good. If only we had a bomb, we could blow up a Titan Rock. And that would be amazing, because Titan Rocks are good. Amazing, some may say. Ah, thank you, game. I'm totally not going to that's a bomb judgement. I'm going to put it here instead. Ah! Oh ho! speed down and the damage up, I don't care if it's a speed down. My speed is kind of terrible right now, but I like damage, so... Yeah, hey, buddy, I keep getting bombs, but I keep having better things to use them for. If I get flight from the Devil Room, I'll get this one and give that to you. Wow, I am really slow now. Oh, we might need to find a speed up somewhere. I could get flights from the devil room, I don't know. Any of that would be useful. Okay. Fish do Pretty damn easy boss. As long as you're not an idiot and do what I just did and break like 50. Oh my god, stop walking into the boss! And break like 50 pieces because I have no choice because I have homing and it homes on anyone it wants and it's really annoying. I didn't know that that uh, would be what was happening before. Huh. I took way more damage than I should have. Okay. Box and a devil room. I totally want that. I totally don't want this, but I'll touch it and re-roll it. I totally don't want that either, but it gets me one third weight being gobby. Alright. So I think the mark gives us a damage up. I'm debating if I sh I actually want to take that off, so I can get a bomb. Two bombs actually for bomb judgement. Wheel of Fortune, give me a slot machine somewhere. By somewhere I mean the room I'm in. Um, Tears up, that's a good pill. Um, I'd rather take this for now, and then maybe I'll use that for something after I use this card. Maybe. Okay, so we're one further away to being guppy, which gives us a gives us flight and gives us um, fly spawn, which is the blue flies we have around right now. My God, I am so slow. Um, every time we hit an enemy, which does. Double law damage, I think. So that'd be pretty good. Jerks. Right, come on. Bob up. Thank you. I still haven't found the item rooms. Oh, yeah, I forgot there was an next level. I don't know how I forgot that, I just like recently fought two bosses. But I somehow managed to forget that. Okay. There's another bomb to get the bomb judgment. There's another bomb to get the bomb judgment. Um. Okay. Hello, Globins. Go away. There we go. We're getting pretty. Another bomb, wow. Like, I'm gonna go give this to bomb judgment. 
I actually need one cent. So can you give me one cent, please? You suck. You know that? You suck. God damn it. <laughs> Just gave him all my bombs. Frack. Okay, there's the item room at last. One of two. This is the next level four. There's two. And I can one shot these fires, which is amazingly good. Uh, Celtic Cross is okay. But I'm going to reroll it. Scapula, I will have to take that. When I get down to a half heart, I can give a soul heart. Which I am actually very close to being able to farm um, to break the game because I now have that and if I get one cent I can buy Nun's Habit. Hello. Uh, Pride, but your name's been changed for Community Remix for some reason. Probably to reference someone, I'm not sure who. Because I didn't really pay attention. The Magician, that is like completely useless because it gives me homing for a room, which I already have, permanently. So. We finally got the money we needed, we can go buy the habit. So we can break the game as soon as we find the D20. Which I might find soon, never know. It could be in the next item room, which would be kind of bad because I don't want it to be. I'm gonna give you more bombs. You suck. A jerk. Alright, so now every time we take damage, we get half of a reroll. Uh, at least I think that's how it works in this current patch. It might have changed to be a, a third re-roll re in a different patch, or I don't know. The ladder actually seems to be being quite beneficial for us. It's a piece of crap, but it's quite beneficial sometimes. Because I can do that and get a free bomb and a free gate. I need to find this next item room so we have something to re-roll. I do have another bomb, I can get to bomb judgments. I don't know whether his chance of giving you something resets after you leave the room, or what, but I guess we'll go try and get to him. I really hope your chance doesn't reset when you leave, because that would be really annoying, because it means that I just keep giving him one and then him resetting. He might reset, I don't know. Just I was hoping he'd give me an item that I could re-roll. But he hasn't. So Oh, thank you, give me. Uh thank you, frame rate. Okay, last time room has got to be over here. It's gonna be like connected to this room, I'm sure, but it's not. Wow. Okay, this is a big floor. Even for an XL floor. Key, okay. Thank you, Ladder. You are actually helpful. That room's... If I damage myself, I can get a chance of getting a chest. Which I don't really care. I do have a lot of keys. Okay, another bomb for bomb judgement. Um... There we are. Dead bird is kind of bad. That is kind of really good. It's, I think any non-specific soul heart has a 50% chance. I mean, non-specific heart has a 50% chance of becoming a soul heart, so it gives you more soul hearts, less red hearts. Is basically what I'm saying. And that's pretty good, actually. Uh, flat penny. I think the Mom's Pearl gives me incre increased soul heart chance, but Flat Penny gives me whenever I pick up money, I have a 50% chance of getting a key. I don't know why I'm doing this room. There's like no reason for it. I don't really need a reroll, and the chest 
gave me like bugger all really. So <laughs> kinda pointless honestly. I guess I just felt like fighting more enemies for some reason. Cause I'm pretty powerful. Key, sweet. It was all worth it in the end. And I'm actually gonna take the risk of taking damage to get all of these um one cents. For that reason. Oh wow, I got a double key. <laughs> This has been a very profitable room for us. This has been the greatest room ever. We got four keys in three cents. Look at the amount of keys we have. We have 11. So good. <laughs> We've got one last bomb to give to Bomb Judgment. And if he doesn't pay out, he is a scrub. And if he does pay out, he is the greatest man ever. Next to... I can't play any great men off the top of my head. You suck! You suck so hard. You dick. Eternal heart. Seems we're leaving the floor. And I guess we'll take the slot machine card down. Because why not? Honestly. There's no real reason for me to take it unless I were into an arcade and I want to make double play machines for less time spent and that kind of stuff. So, Sin Heart becomes a full heart, full red heart at the start of the next floor. That's why I use it at the end, so I guarantee getting your health up. And if I like, played a Blood Bank, I would have lost it for the potential of a health up and speed up. Which I do actually need a speed up a fair bit. I also need an item room. All that room works. Okay, frame rate's not good in this room. I'm not actually sure if it's the frame rate or just the fact that Isaac's moving very slowly. That makes you think the frame rate's choppy. God damn it. Hate masks and hearts. They suck so much. Homing's actually helped me out a bit here. No, no key that time. That was a crap chest. Thanks, game. Would have preferred a guppy item. Preferably guppy's paw, so I could have re-rolled it and then got guppy and dead cat. But whatever. Whatever. Not very community remixy yet. Let's get some community remix stuff. Right, this is a... God damn it, why did I walk into that? Oh god damn it, this room sucks! Oh my god, I took so much damage on this room. For absolutely no reason. That big brain I'm weaving for no reason. Okay, thank you for taking pity on me and giving me a soul heart back. And a key, okay. It all worked out. I don't think Necropolis 1 is mom. I think that she is on 2. So we are okay to fight our boss, I think. Money and potentially a lot of keys? Oh yes, you know it. <laughs> If I'm wrong, then I will remember this for future because I'll be an idiot. Good, I wasn't wrong. I moved, I'm sure of it. I'm sure I moved in time, but apparently not. I think this boss fight's pretty easy, if I'm honest. Just like occasionally dodge his shots. And then he does a. Why did I dodge it? That's what I get for saying this room's easy. I need that speed up. I actually do need that speed up. Oh, thank God for that. Right. That's what I get for saying that room's easy. I took loads of damage in there because I was being an idiot. Being an idiot. God damn it. I'm Batman. No, not another mask. 
Suck a dick, heart. G go away. Another mask and heart room. I hate this game sometimes. Jesus. Please just die. They have so much health. They have as much health as a boss. My god. Okay, I'm probably going to go to the shop because I think it'll be greed. I'm lucky that didn't hit me. The um, angle of his bounce saved me. Okay, I think this will be greed. No, no, it's not good. I will take the map, happily. I will also buy this pill. Bad gas, that's completely useless. It will poison nearby enemies, but I don't care. Alright, now I've got an item room at last. Ooh. I just picking it up for the um, increased library chance. No, I don't want that. Now, I can re-roll that infinitely, and I'm probably going to do that, even though it's a really, really, really bad idea. Hopefully, I find a blood bank somewhere. Ow! God damn it! Come on, got hit by the hand so bad. Stupid cheating bee workers. Okay, this room shouldn't be too bad. Unless I'm absolutely terrible bad myself, which I assume we am because I might have spawn so many flies and I'm not killing them. There we go. Now we're golden. Now we are golden. Oop. Okay, I've got two more rooms, which means I won't get a reroll, but I can damage myself to get rerolls. Which I am actually going to do. Actually, there's also that room, which I haven't opened yet, I don't think, so we'll, we can get another reroll that way. One bottle of pills, I might get a good pill, let's see. You're funny, game. You're really, really funny sometimes. Thanks for that one room teleport. I really appreciate it. I really do. Alright, let's see what we get in this. No keys from that. Oh. I get some money and some bomb stuff, so. I would like one more cent if I can, so I can have the um, arcade chance for the next floor. That'd be great if I could get that. I think, is this almost glitch to spawn two waves, or does that count as one wave? Oh, that's count as one wave, alright, okay. Even though they were different enemies. Hey, go away, knights, go away. Homing is sort of helping me. Sort of and sort of not really. I did I no. Because it just like homes directly on them, but if I fire from behind them, I'm okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'm comfortable doing the infinite reroll thing if I have to. Hopefully I will just get something good after I beat these two rooms and get that re-roll, but that is kind of unlikely, honestly. Go away. Right now I can just do this room normally and just destroy it completely. Alright. We are decently powerful. I've got so many keys. I am the key master. Oh. Okay. Ultra Pride. Great. 
We kind of decimated that one, Jesus. I think this will drop the um, left hand. I'm glad I was out the range of that. Is it the left hand that's called a think? Are you out? Are you out this ball? You should be dead. Left hand, yeah. That, that would give me an increased chance of becoming guppy. Because it would mean all chest spawns are red chests, but I'd rather take the flat penny and get keys. If I'm honest. So. I. Do I want that? I can get something better. Okay. I'll take that. Eh, but I didn't have to give away all my health, that's good. So we still have a soul heart to protect this next floor. Even though next floor devil room doesn't matter because we're fighting mom and unless I can get the teleport out, I can't get the devil room, so. You know. But also the soul hearts are helpful for just keeping me alive. Seeing as I'm not the greatest band of asset by ever. I'm okay, not amazing. Skip that. Right. Because with the map, we can now see where the secret room is ahead of time. Why didn't I get the secret room on the last floor? I don't know. Did I get the secret room on the last floor? I can't remember. I think I did, actually. Never mind. Ignore me. So many keys. So good. I could have totally gotten him to blow that up for me, but I didn't. Screw you, game. Okay. That works. Lots of keys. Plenty of money. It's all good. Hopefully the item moves this way. Damn it, I want them to hit the TNT. Hit the TNT, you jerk. Fine, forget the TNZ, I'm just blowing it up so I don't walk into it while I'm shooting it myself and die. Well, not die, but take damage. Go on, job. You're being unnecessary here, just die. Thank you. I also appreciate the soul heart. Great. I'd rather not come this way. If I can. Ow! Blow that up, please. Oh, come on! That's so blow it up. Come on, guys. Yeah, stop being jerks. There we go. Right. But you all to go that way. Leave. Because we know there's no end room of importance up there, so I want to set the three rolls. Uh, next potential end room is up this way. So let's go for this. Eh, eh, eh. No. Boom. And it's shop. Okay, we'll go with that. There's a chance it will be greed, I think. We haven't actually run it agreed yet, but if it is, then I could probably get a reroll pedestal. And if it's not, then I can potentially get a nice item that I will want to get later on. And I've got loads of keys, and I will probably get enough money to go to it. Ow! If I need to, I can blow up this um, Wheel of Fortune I'm carrying with me. Another key. Yeah, it's great, okay. I walk right into that. I deserve that, but I get more keys, so. It's all good. Not really, because I have slightly less money now. But I get a bunch of keys from that, so. <laughs> Actually, I got, like, none. What was that ball plot grade? You cheeky bugger. Back now, 
How many times do I have to fight the fish to a room? Seriously, I've run into it so many times. It's insane. God, God damn it, I couldn't have dodged that. Unless I was better at the game, in which case I could have. But that's not going to happen. I'm not going to get better at this game. It'd be silly. Ow! God. Oh my god. I am so bad at this sometimes. So bad at this game sometimes. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, bomb. Sweet. Night room? No, it's boss room. God, <laughs> I can't go with that yet. Oh my god, you fired up so much faster than you should have. What is wrong with you? I'm now going to have to blow this up. I should have bombed on top and be the second secret room there. I am at great risk of dying here. Which is a bit of a problem if you look at it logically. I have got three hits in me. Well, yeah, I need to get to a half, half interval if I can. So that if I get down to. So that when I get down to half a heart, I will have an extra hit. Otherwise, I'm in trouble. Okay, we're getting somewhere. Item room? Yes! Thank you! Thank you, Merciful Isaac. Oh my god. Actually... Was I at half a soul heart? Or... Already? Or... Did enemies still do half a heart? I can't remember. I do not remember in the slightest. Uh, let's go see what's in there. Game kid. Bad. Infestation. Kinda bad. Screw you, bro. Oh, god damn it. I didn't want to get hit there. Ugh. Oh, frack. I'm so gonna get hit in this room and die. It's so gonna happen. Okay. It didn't happen, thank god. We roll the item room. We get... Okay. That gives me increased library chance, it doesn't really matter at this point because we've basically picked up every book from the freaking library. Uh, I'm gonna do this. It's kinda dumb. But we're gonna do it. Shot speed down. Okay, that's good. I found pills and ate them. That's neutral. Okay. So we're down to um, a half heart thing. So that's actually perfect. Um. So now, if we take. A full heart of damage off mom, a uh, full red heart of damage off mom, then we will get scapula activated and we will not die. Instantly. We will die later on. Obviously. Alright, I'm done with this floor basically. Where's the two rooms I left the which I do actually need to go to because I need to get a um, bit more of a charge from the mom fight. In case I do it flawlessly and don't take damage. Which is incredibly unlikely. If I didn't get that speed up before, I wouldn't be able to outrun these guys, so. So that's good. At least that was worth taking. And. this room. I don't like the one it's room, but I'll do it for any consumables I might get. Come on. Just die. Sweet. So what? Hashtag worth. I've already been to the secret room, I think. 
you know, I had bomb not there. I was like, I could have got that guy to do it for me, but I didn't. So yeah, I thought we'd just bomb it and blah blah. All right, let's go fight mom. Let's cheese. If we can. Which we actually can, good. La 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 la. Just hang out here for a while. Hopefully, no annoying enemies spawn like that jerk. Can we get back to this, please? There we go. Go away, fly. Die. Yes. Sweet! And I got the ball road. So now when we get down to a half heart, we get invincibility. So we definitely want to stick with the half heart deal. I could actually right, find a blood bank. I could actually get down to permanent ball road invincibility. Which would be amazing. Because that means every time I get hit, I get like five seconds of invincibility, which gives me a chance to get up. I get my cube meat to do some damage, and for every soul heart, I get another chance of doing that. So, let's ow, not suck at this game as much as we are currently. Let's hope we do that. Money equals keys. Like money equals power. Any keys. I'm up to 30 keys, holy crap. It's ridiculous. I definitely don't really need to drink anymore, but. Whatever. Oh, oh my god, how did I not take damage though? That was so. completely on purpose? That was like 100% intended, yes. That was just so skillful. Wow, I have gotten much better at this game than anyone else could ever hope to be. In reality, that was like completely luck, obviously. Because I'm not very good at this game. <laughs> I'm okay, like I said, but not amazing. I was not getting amazing frame rate when they both jump. Hopefully, frame rate's a bit more top notch in Rebirth. Which I have not yet pre ordered, but I will do soon. I think you get like. Is it 33? Uh, yeah, it's about 33% off. Or just 30% off, I'm not sure. Somewhere around a third. Either exactly a third or around about a third off if you own the Binding of which I do. So. Okay, we're going to take that in a second. That gives me a fire rate up. The trinket cancer. In all other situations, you obviously do not own cancer, but in Binding of you do. Alright. We should be able to do this from about taking damage, I hope. Or well, I'm just terrible at it, this game. Which I've said several times I am, so we're probably going to take damage here. Let's be honest. Let's be honest with ourselves. My shot speed actually helped me though, because I think it knocked him down slightly and then he didn't hit me and I had to walk out. Bye, job. Oh, goddamn. Dawn Monster again. Sick of fighting Dawn Monster. It's like fish you all over again. It's it annoying after like two fights. I mean, it kills my frame rate. My kills, I mean, it drops it down by like. I don't know, probably at like 20. Maybe 15. I can actually look over the recording, but. I am not really in a position to do that right now because I don't want to damage on this room for no reason. Other than the fact that I was looking to see what my frame rate was. <laughs> Such a dumb reason to take damage. Apparently we're at zero drop frames, so maybe that's me just feeling this? I don't know. Where would the boss be? 
Where would this boss be? Let's check down. Globans and these guys whose names I don't know. Just big gaping stomach wound guys, or that to, is their mouth? I don't know. I assume it's their mouth, I... I'm assuming they have a mouth. They might not, for all I know. And that just might be their stomach, and they eat, literally eat through their stomach. Cut, cut out the middle, man. No need for a throat. You just suck it into your stomach, and there you go. Boom, bam, done. Come on. Pop up. Thank you. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want it, though. I nearly took that, it gives me half a soul heart, which is pretty good, and that's a thing introduced in Community Remix. But I would rather keep my half heart interval. If I can. If I can't, then you know. Oh, wow, that's a lot of money. By a lot of money, I mean a lot of money for this game, not in real life. A dime. There's no reason for me to do these end rooms. Well, I'm just looking for the boss, and I know that they're not end rooms I care about. Because they're not a library, they're not an item room because they can't be, and they're not a shop because I don't think they can be. And they will be a, They're not a cursed room. They may be a self sacrifice room, I don't know. Homing is still helping a bit. I think that shot speed down we got before actually helps homing quite a bit. Makes it better. Because they have the shots travel slower and have more of a chance to actually home. So that is always nice to improve what you've already got. Okay. Uh, let's go back to the Another horseman? Are you kidding me? What's with your other horseman? It's the third one I thought. Oh god damn it, that hit me. Suck a dick. Jerk. God, he's... Oh my god, my shot speed knocked that down when I walked into it. Because I wasn't expecting to get knocked down. I hate this guy. Jerk face jerk, and he spawns knights. Thank you for killing those knights. They are so annoying. There we go. Right. Give me. Can't re roll that. Boss room. Preferably a one heart deal. Um. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm not taking that, that's flight, but I will die and respawn as Blue Baby, who has, screw it, we're doing it, we're doing it, hashtag YOLO and stuff, okay so now we can fly and we have pretty decent rate of fire and stuff, I think the fight was actually worth it, honestly. I will probably die at some point because I currently have zero health, so any hit will kill me. I shouldn't have fired that actually. <laughs> I'm lucky that didn't hit me. So at some point we're going to die. Potentially even in this room. And then we will respawn as Blue Baby, who will have three soul hearts. So basically, we paid one soul heart. For the ability to fly, which is a pretty decent deal, actually. Okay, a library at last. At last, a library. Okay. 
touch these books. I think we should have got most amount of the pool by now. Okay, this fight can't be a horseman, so I'm happy to do this. Alright, hopefully we will be able to get some more rerolls for that. Now... Oh! I've got to take this. I believe that every time I pick up money I have a chance of getting a soul heart. So for that reason we're going to do this. Yep. Okay. That worked out. Cancer is very good in this game, but I like the soul heart stuff and also it's community room excitement, so we are better off taking a community room excitement, a community remix game run through, play through, don't know what the correct term is for a brand new it run there you go, brand new it run, there we go, got it in the end ah oh. I thought that might have been the last book in the pool Alright. I'm actually going to stick with this Soul Penny. Gun's Trick is very good, but what if we find like greed in the chest? Then we could get a bunch of money and get a bunch of Soul Hearts. It'd be great. It'd be the greatest thing since sliced bread. So, the sliced bread's pretty damn good. You ever had unsliced bread? Ugh. Not a hassle. Not chewing. I've never had unsliced bread. <laughs> I mean, I've sliced bread when I like purchased it from a retailer who a re is retailer the correct term for a bread salesman, a baker, from a baker who has left it in an unsliced form. But that's about the extent I've gone to having unsliced bread. What the fuck am I on? <laughs> Oh dear me. This has been a pretty long run actually. For an hour. I don't know why it's been so long. I haven't like done any breaking. Are you kidding me? It's still not. The fucking double item room. Why not? <laughs> God damn it. God fucking damn it. All right. Hello, Chub. Are you spawning two enemies at once, you cheat? I'm not really sure which would be the better choice. The survivability. Taking the soul heart trinkets or taking the fire rate trinket. My fire rate seems a lot slower, but soul hearts are essential to me living, so. Balls of steel, oh yes. So good. Oh god damn it, that hit me. Suck at it, game. Might as well take that gas. It might be useful at some point. Probably not, but you know, it might be. Right, I, I am hoping that this is the last time I have to re-roll this. I'm quickly going to go pop this somewhere, so that if I get the d20 I can re-roll them. I'm going to put it out of the way so I don't have to keep walking through the room and rushing. There we go. Now we can reroll this, and it should be a double item room. It should. Why didn't we get libraries there? I picked up so many books, and they each increase your library chance. 
So let's go see Marcus fire it through him. Alright. I'm actually going to take this. And crap, the sky is just bad, so I'm not going to take that. I've got 33 keys, just need to get another 36 and I'll be happy. So we now have quad shots, means we fire four in four attacks each time, so hopefully that will not screw me over. I mean, I think it's basically just a damaging piece as long as you hit them with at least two of them. See? Like, it completely wrecks those guys. I'm going to sit on the rocks and kill you too, because I have no intention of getting hit. Because why would I? Poison Torch! That's actually really good. With the speed down, so... That's kind of bad. Tears up! Excellent. I need that now, because of this. I'm getting carried quite hardcore now. Right, uh, from the Mom's Heart fight, I am 98% confident you don't get a item, so let's go re-roll our library. And who knows, maybe we'll get a D20. I kind of doubt it. What we could do, we could do, that'd be great, but, hmm, probably not going to be happening. Like, 98.2% um, confirmed by me that it's not going to happen. Okay. That's actually really good, because we're in polar order of its body. Uh, so that gives us like a speed and a damage up when we are at half a heart or permanent soul hearts. Just soul hearts. So. Did I go to this? If I didn't, who cares? Didn't want that. <laughs> Alright. I was really hoping to get some money from that so I get some soul hearts, but mm. oh, right. Let's go fight Mom's heart. Rip. Die already. Right, it should actually go really smoothly. Apart from the frame rate, obviously that's not going smoothly at all. That's going very unsmoothly. But, you know, I think we basically won this. In fact, I think we've done this flawlessly. Yep. Alright, now in Community UX, I know you can go down to Satan rather than have to go to the Cathedral. And then you can fight Satan instead of Isaac, and then you can go up the chest all the same. So we're going to do that. Because that's a more fun fight. And I have more of a chance of winning that. Oh! God, that didn't pick that off. I could give me a soul horse and stuff, but... Oh well. I guess just walk into you with... a cube of meat. Boss room? No. I'm going to do this if that's dumb. Gives us brimstone for a room. I actually don't like brimstone, so... We're going to reroll that. I don't want that. I'm willing to do this once. I kind of don't actually want that, but we'll do it. I don't know why I actually took that, I don't like the knife at all. And it's actually made worse by the fact that we got quad shots, so... So there's that. I don't like this item at all, so... I might have actually thrown this run. In 
back, I think after this room, I'm going to try and do some spider moddy stuff. And see if we can remove this. Uh, hang on, let me just check if I can. Uh, cheats, get a four set, show me. Hmm. I don't know how I would do this. Uh. Hmm. Maybe we do this. No, that doesn't help me. Uh. Hmm. They will no. Uh, edit ops. Excellent. Um. No, that's not what I want. No, I have no idea how to do this. So, looks like we're stuck with mom's knife, which sucks because I don't want it. I just like took it in a panic. Because of the fact that I had to get out of that room quick before I was going to take more damage. So, yeah. So I deserve it, really. God damn it, I didn't want to. Oh. There. Okay. God damn I have reduced damage now, I feel like. Because my fire rate's so low with the knife. I mean, it does a poop ton of damage, but... You know. Uh, okay. I just told me to a random room because there's no shop on this floor. God damn it, this actually took me further away than I want than I was, so obviously it took me further away than I want. I would have been better off just fighting that room, I think. That way I wouldn't have to fight a bunch of guys. Well I would, but not as many guys I've got to fight now. Come on, already. We have to aim for the, like the bottom eye. Damn it! Let's do this. I don't want that, really. I suppose I'll take it though. Crap, back up. Okay. I will die if I take one more hit. Oh, I died. Okay. Well, we respawn like this. So, that's okay. Now it's not. I basically threw this run when I picked up the knife. So that's not good. I want to re-roll that. I also wish I hadn't picked up this uh, eternal heart. Because I've guaranteed myself a health up if I survive. So that's actually really bad. Because then I won't have permanent polar invincibility. 
So I have thrown this run so hard. It's insane. I didn't know you could throw this hard. I've watched Northern Line for a while, so... I should know. Oh, god damn. Unless this... Actually, no, wait, 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 wait. We're Blue Baby now. We are Blue Baby now. So, if we get a health up, it will become a soul heart. So we're okay. We're okay. Phew. Thank God for that. Not you. God damn it, go suck a dick. There. Right. Let's do this. I think one more reroll. Nope. Now we'll just. No, we'll save all rerolls for the um, thingy. Yes, that was actually perfectly timed. Sweet. I glitched his health bar. Now it's working again. Okay, I might die here. Ow. Come on, kill it! Yes! Forget me now has appeared in this. What? Why has everything not been unlocked on this? I don't know. But okay. Um, let's go down and hope we live. Okay, um, I'll take the range up and re roll the rest of the crap. Um, I don't really want any of that. I want to kill Lost, like now. Damn it! Come on, Greed. No, not Greed. Gluttony. Die. Look at that left. Gave me what I wanted to sweep. Wow, that wrecked you, didn't it? <laughs> and that wrecked you, sweet. <laughs> Go back and re-roll my items. I don't want any of that, really. And then again... Fly could be useful for when I'm... Uh, attacking Blue Baby when I have Paul Rudd in this body. There was that. Goddamn, like, widow of some kind. Stupid widow spawning spiders. Stupid spiders. Dying to my knife repeatedly. That's not like a really fucked up person. Killing spiders with a knife? What the fuck? What's wrong with you? I do want to get one more reroll before we fight. I hope I don't take damage. Fuck me in the anus. Okay. We might lose. Or we might not. We'll see. Okay. I'll take that. And I'll take that. Both kind of terrible. Ter terribly bad items. But. Whatever. We might be able to do this. I'm dead. Oh god. I'm so dead. Yeah, I died. Okay. Well, I'm, I'll accept that. I died on Blue Baby. Which is further than I was actually expecting to get, but yeah, that works. So that's the first one. Hope you enjoyed that. Please leave a like if you want. I would appreciate that. And I will see you in another one I'm probably going to do. I just think it's funny that we've got, um.
little chub or whatever it is, just like gnawing on the side of the screen there. Right here. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Okay, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that, and I will see you next time. Bye.